Hello, and welcome to another episode of China Record. In latest news, China's groundbreaking technological advancements have once again intensified the ongoing U.S.-China tech war, leading to heightened tensions between the two nations. This escalating tension is also having a ripple effect on other tech companies worldwide. Taking a closer look at China's border, we find that one of the world's leading semiconductor foundries, TSMC, is currently facing a significant challenge. As you may know, TSMC is the largest chip maker globally and plays a crucial role in the global supply chain. However, due to unforeseen circumstances, TSMC has requested its supplier to delay chipmaking tools. This unexpected development has raised concerns about potential disruptions in the semiconductor industry. Meanwhile, on the other side of the globe, a new project in the United States is also experiencing delays. The primary reason behind these delays is a shortage of skilled laborers. What is going on now? TSMC is a major contributor to the semiconductor industry in many ways. Here are some of the aspects that show how TSMC has influenced and shaped the industry. TSMC pioneered the foundry business model, which allows chip designers to outsource the manufacturing process to TSMC instead of investing in their own fabrication facilities. This enables faster time to market, lower costs, and more innovation for the chip designers as well as more flexibility and scalability for TSMC. TSMC is the world's largest and most advanced contract chip maker, serving customers from various sectors, such as Apple, AMD, Qualcomm, Nvidia, and Huawei. TSMC invests heavily in research and development, as well as in building state-of-the-art fabrication facilities. TSMC has developed cutting-edge manufacturing processes, such as the 7 nanometer NM, and 5 nanometers nodes, which allow for the production of smaller and more powerful chips. TSMC is also the first to start high-volume manufacturing of its 3 nanometers process, which is expected to be more profitable and offer significant performance and power improvements superscript 1. TSMC's technological leadership has enabled it to produce over 50% of the world's semiconductor chips and 90% of the most advanced chips. TSMC has a strategic supply chain management system, which ensures that it can source the raw materials and equipment needed for its production. TSMC also works closely with its suppliers and customers to optimize its inventory and delivery. TSMC has a global footprint, with fabrication facilities in Taiwan, China, Singapore, and the US. TSMC is expanding its presence in the US, with plans to build a massive new fab in Arizona, which will be the most advanced chip factory in America. TSMC's global expansion aims to diversify its risks, serve its customers better, and strengthen its competitive edge. TSMC has a unique corporate culture, which emphasizes dedication, excellence, innovation, and teamwork. TSMC's founder Morris Chong highlighted the importance of talent retention and low employee turnover rates in maintaining Taiwan's leadership in the global semiconductor industry. TSMC also fosters a collaborative environment among its employees, customers, and partners. TSMC values customer satisfaction and loyalty and strives to meet their expectations and needs. TSMC also contributes to social responsibility and environmental sustainability through various initiatives and programs. But looks at its US's market, TSMC is a Taiwanese semiconductor company that faces challenges in the US market. Some of these challenges include worker shortage, higher building costs, and U.S. cannibalization of its technology and customers. TSMC also risks losing the Chinese market and being replaced by U.S. competitors. TSMC may not receive adequate protection from the Taiwanese government. Lawsuit from Global Foundries, a rival chipmaker based in New York, which accused it of infringing on 16 of its patents related to various semiconductor technologies. Global Foundries sought damages and an injunction to stop TSMC from selling or importing chips that use those technologies in the US and Germany. TSMC denied the allegations and said that it would defend itself vigorously. 
It also said that the lawsuit was an attempt by global foundries to disrupt its business and gain an unfair advantage in the market. Double taxation rule that prevents it from expanding further in the U.S. Since the U.S. does not have an income tax agreement with Taiwan, TSMC faces double taxation on its profits from its Arizona factory or any other factory it could build in the States. Delay in opening its Arizona factory, which is expected to start making 4 nanometers chips in 2024 and 3 nanometers chips in 2026, making it the most advanced chip factory in America. TSMC said that the delay was partly due to a lack of skills and experience among U.S. workers, as well as some management and safety issues on the site. TSMC is trying to get visas for as many as 500 Taiwanese technicians to assist with construction and training on the site. But it faces opposition from a local labor union that accuses it of misrepresenting the skill set of Arizona's workforce and threatening U.S. jobs. These are some of the current issues that TSMC is facing in America. TSMC is a major contributor to the semiconductor industry and a key player in the global economy and society. However, it also faces various political and commercial pressures from different countries and competitors. TSMC has to balance its interests and strategies carefully to maintain its technological leadership and competitive edge. According to the Reuters report, TSMC has asked its major suppliers to delay the delivery of high-end chip-making equipment for several reasons. TSMC is growing increasingly nervous about customer demand, as it faces weaker economic conditions, a slower recovery in China, and softer in-market demand. TSMC wants to control its costs and inventory levels, and avoid overcapacity or oversupply. TSMC is grappling with delays at its $40 billion chip factory in Arizona, which is expected to start making 4 nanometers chips in 2024 and 3 nanometers chips in 2026. TSMC faces a shortage of skilled workers with the specialized expertise required for equipment installation in a semiconductor grade facility. TSMC also faces some management and safety issues on the site. TSMC is cautious about the outlook for demand as it expects the chip market to remain weak until the second half of the year. TSMC forecasted another 4% to 9% sequential drop in its revenue for the second quarter of 2023. So what's the future of TSMC? The outlook of TSMC is not very clear, as the company faces various challenges and uncertainties in the market. TSMC has reduced its 2023 capital expenditure outlook to closer to the bottom end of the previously forecast $32 billion to $36 billion range. TSMC reaffirmed projections for revenue in the first half of 2023 to decline by about 10% in U.S. dollar terms. TSMC is grappling with delays at its $40 billion chip factory in Arizona which is expected to start making 4 nanometers chips in 2024 and 3 nanometers chips in 2026. However, it also faces various political and commercial pressures from different countries and competitors. TSMC has to balance its interests and strategies carefully to maintain its technological leadership and competitive edge.